Patrita, Vishnu, Kukoya, another wire from the coil, the other side. Also this one. And neon bulb. You hear it going slowing down on the moment when I connect this lid with this lid the motor will go faster and this is a neon bulb so there is only a gap between with some gas in it and when it lifts there you got your radiant energy the only thing that is from iron is the shaft for the rest you see here uh, some big big magnets these are uh, rare earth magnets and this is uh, this is uh, a, a PVC pipe a plastic pipe so uh, no no iron at all and here is windings up and down it's one coil but you really have to make two rings up and down I don't uh, I didn't do it uh, exact so I don't know how many turns this is but uh, I just used the wire that I could uh, get my hands on by uh, taking it out of uh, machines like this you know just cutting it and then you have to spin all this wire off it's uh, really difficult to get uh, a big spool of uh, clear wire um, this here is for one side of the battery uh, as experiment to see uh, if uh, if a PD PVM uh, module will improve some things and if I play around with the frequency buttons uh, rough frequency precise frequency and very precise frequency and uh, volt um, this is the ampere uh, 1 ampere to 5 ampere it's barely using 100 ampere and you can see also that this is like going all directions doesn't want to stay and if I tune with it it changes uh, right and if I tune it to a right sweet point because it's really not exact it can be if you go to high it uh, it goes slower if you go to low it goes also slower now I hit a sweet point Sometimes I can adjust these ones. I really uh, want to know uh, a nice diagram for uh, doing this with MOSFETs and uh, and optic eyes. So I can just make a disc with little holes in it to make the right timing. I think this will improve a lot. Uh, the digital meters don't know to handle this stuff this is across one pack of batteries and it's switching really 
it really doesn't know what to do. So that's why I use this thing also to indicate, but uh, he's right. Uh, it's going all kind of weird things. And uh, this happens when every time when there is a big shock uh, happening. And it's going so fast, even the meter cannot show that, you know. Uh, yeah, you see it in my earlier videos, you see that uh, you can really see it on the scope. But this is also a perfect way to see that there is something more than that can get out of the battery. So. And again, if I disconnect the lid, you will hear the motor slowing down a bit. And as soon as I fly, if I connect it again, you can hear it going up again. Sometimes you can see it here also very clear. And I think I have to put a neon bulb on this one, so I have to find another screwdriver that has one. Because really, it, uh, I cannot just go around uh, the corner and grab some uh, stuff out of the shop. So. You have to do it with the stuff that I have around me. Well, that was just another uh, experience. All the things that I do, I uh, mostly uh, find them out now and then I grab the camera with it. So, uh, yeah.